Hello everybody, this is Connie and welcome back to Swatching It. And this week we are going to use the BH Cosmetics Forever Nude Palette. I've had this one for quite a while. I don't use it near enough. And it's got, it says it's got eyeshadow, blush, highlighter, and lip color palette. And we are going to swatch it all. So it's got the six eyeshadows in here. This is supposed to be a highlighter. I'm not real sure. It doesn't look like a highlighter to me. It looks more like a eyeshadow base. And then it's got your blush and your bronzer and two lipsticks here. So we will swatch them all. So let's get started. I will tell you what I'm doing. First of all, I have got my Laura Geller spackle laid down on my arm. I've given it time to dry. I, As usual, I clean my brushes in here in between every swatch and I wipe my fingers off on my very dirty <laughs> um, makeup remover pad. And I am using today my Echo Tools and this is, it says it's a or def, Define and Shade Brush. So right here is the side I'm going to use. This is the other side. I'm not going to do that one. So I'm going to use this one. So here we go. We're going into the bronzer shade first. And it's a very, I don't know, very hard to see. It, like a, a almost a pinky toned bronzer. To me, see, I don't bronze, so this would look good on me as a uh, matte, or as a transition shade. Don't know if you can even see that. Here we go with the blush. It looks almost like a peachy, almost corally shade of blush. Isn't a whole lot of difference between that and the bronzer, actually. Very pretty color. Very light, though. So, again, I'm not real sure that you can see it. Here we go into the highlighter. I'm going to do these, and then I'm going to wipe my... Or, and the lipsticks and then I'm going to wipe my arm off so we can go into the, fresh into the eyeshadows. See I can't even see where I swatched. This is just a very base color. It's not a highlighter color at all. There is no shimmer, no no reflection, nothing. So this did, did us absolutely no good because I don't believe that you can even see any of those but I will keep it in the palette. Here we go with the lipsticks. And I am just going to do finger swatches on the lipsticks. I don't want to get my brush out right now. That is a very peachy coral color. And the next is more of a pink. And I have used this one a couple of times. There you go. Okay, so I am going to go ahead and wipe my arm off and we will go on with the eyeshadows in this palette. Okay, everybody, I am back and I have reapplied my Laura Geller primer to my skin. And here we go cleaned everything off just gonna redo it one more time here we go very pretty kind of a, almost like a peachy everything's kind of peach toned in this but it looks kind of like a peach toned um, with lots of shimmer. Oh, it's really pretty. Kind of a pinky shimmer. Okay, and we are going to go across and across and across. The next one's more of a, almost like a, well, 
I was going to say a taupey shade, um, but that's not what it looks like on the skin. This is more, <laughs> dare I say, peachy again. Beautiful, though, those two colors. Okay, and the next two are mattes. And this is a pink. And the next one is a cream, so I don't know if you're going to be able to see it. Well, look at there. That one there actually even shows up. I like BH Cosmetics. The next one is a, looks in the pan like a bronzy shimmer. Oh, this is right up my alley, this color. Beautiful. And the last one is a black. And this one here is actually a pretty good black. Okay, let me get my brush and my fingers cleaned off here. There you go, guys. Start with the black and then the bronze. Then we went with the cream and the pink that were matte. And then with the, um, I'm still going to go with taupey color and almost like a mauve color, mauve pink, that first color. Although a lot of them are very, still very light. This is the palette that we used. Look at how shiny that is. That is so pretty. A lot of shimmer there. Thank you so much for watching, guys. If you like this sort of video, please give it a thumbs up. I welcome all your comments and suggestions, and we will see you next week in Swatching It. Thank you.